this freaking caudalie thing, caudalie thing. I I was sent it, but now it doesn't work. So I can't like return it, right? Like, I feel like going to the caudalie store. Should I do that and be like, can you fix this for me, please? Like such a waste, right? I don't know what to do. It's <sighs> so annoying. Um. You guys, I can use my samples up. I just figured I would sit here with you guys again here today. You guys know so I get in trouble with things that I say, but whatever. It is what it is. I actually like this. It's like minty. It feels minty. It's the Sisley all day, all year. And it, feels, it smells like, like a little bit minty. I'm not supposed to put it around my eyes. Isn't that right? Someone told me, like, oh my god, you put in the mask around your eyes, like, gonna dry it out. I had no idea. I seriously always put masks, like, up to my fucking brim, thinking it will take away, like, you know, wrinkles and stuff. So stupid. I had no idea. I don't know these things, you know? Like, I didn't, like... Like, my mom isn't, like, a big makeup person at all. Like, growing up, like, I didn't... She never wore makeup, so, like, I didn't know about this kind of thing. Never did mask, like never got facials, so I don't know this kind of stuff. <laughs> I still don't know anything. I have like so much shock, so much fucking shit to do today, you guys. I love this combo. This is one thing that's making me happy. I just love like this oversized shirt with this, like my silver Orion, and this is my. Miami piece, which I love this chain. I want to do more with this chain. I want to make another chain like this, like shorter, I think, because I just love it. And this one, the Miami piece, you can double wrap it into a, a double choker, or you can wear it long like this, and I just love it. And then I'm wearing my silver halo, which is amazing bracelet with this little mini, um, you know, like the hooks on the monsters, the Fendi monsters. It's just like that, but squared off. It's actually nicer. I <laughs> way nicer. I've been so picky about it. And then my HRH chain. Love this combo. It's like my favorite combo. Um, okay, so today I have so much to do. And I was thinking about this, like, subject. And I was like, I wonder what they would say. Because you guys know, like, you are, like, my therapy. You are, like, my friends. But I don't want to, like, get in. I feel like so many people are going to get offended by it. You know, like, be like, like... I don't know. I just feel like this is not the time for this. I don't know. Whatever. Um, this is what I feel like. Like, okay, I work obviously full time. You know what I mean? More than full time. I have my own business, and when you own your own business, it's you work all the time. Like, you don't get to clock out nine to five. You know. So, I mean, I would never give up my business. You guys know, I would never give up HRH for anything in the world. Like, it totally happened randomly like it was never planned you guys know that if you've been following me since the beginning you would have seen how like it happened how i progressed it was just like happened you know it started off with like my little cupcake rings and and like key fob stuff and then like it's things just happened so it just worked out like i'd never taken a design class in my whole life i just knew what i liked um so I love to work. I love to work. I love to work. But now, like, that I'm married, I'm starting to see, like, the discrepancies in how much women have to do. And it's just getting, like, so, like, but it's, like, it's just the way it is, you know? Like, like right now, for example, I have to work today, and um, Ming needs a bath. She needs to go to the groomer, and Nick doesn't know about going to the Korean groomer. Like, that's something I have to do. Like, we ran out of dish soap, so I have to go do that. Um, because he, the thing is like this too, we do split up duties obviously, but because my schedule is more flexible than his, because like I can work from home, I go downtown like to my office like three days a week, you know, on those other two days, I have to do everything I have to do. He doesn't have that like luxury. He like more has meetings and things like that. Um, so anyway, I have to get dish soap, I have to get Nespresso pods, I, you know what I mean? Like, there's things I have to do. 
and I have to come home, I have to make dinner, I have to grocery shop, I have to plan for like the the meals. So I'm like a stay at home mom wife, I'm like a housewife, and I'm fucking the breadwinner. Like how is, I don't know, is that like me to say, okay, like, I'm like, I make the money, I make money, <laughs> shit. And like I have to do all this. Like what, how, what, this is like not fair. And I'm not mad at him, like this is nothing on him, it's just like, how did this happen to us? Like, when did this, this was not, like, this was not the way it used to be. It used to be women sat home, took care, oh my god, can you imagine a fucking kid now? Like, if I had a kid, and I'd, it's impossible. I'd have to have, like, a live-in, like, a full-time nanny, which I don't really like to do. Like, it's not like, I don't feel like that's right. Like, we didn't have, I don't know. I don't know if, like, I'm too controlling. I've never, like, have a nanny at my place all the time. Um, so... When did this happen? Like, when did it happen that, like, women got to be so powerful, I feel like, where we are doing more than men? I don't agree with this at all. I fucking am mad. I'm so mad. Like, why can't I just, like, sit home and be, like, just clean the house and, you know, cook the dinner? Like, I'm doing it already anyway. You know what I mean? Like, Nick could have cook a fucking meal. I would, like, that's disgusting. Like, ew. Like, I, he's not a cook. Um... And if I don't cook, then I'm just going to have to go out and I'm going to be even fatter than I am. So what, like, what is going on with us? Like, what is going on with society? Like, what happened to us? Why do I have to do all this stuff? Like, I, I guess I make it sound like Nick doesn't do anything, which isn't true. Like, he's going to take a shower to get his teeth trimmed. He, like, you know, does things like that kind of stuff. But, like, he can't go grocery shopping because he'll, like, forget something. And I'm not making the fucking list. And he gets home late. So it's like, I, you're already too late. Like, I needed the groceries before to make the dinner. You know what I mean? Like, it's just not fair. Like, I mean, I'm not saying I'm like, I, I just don't understand how this happened. How did, how did it become, how did this happen? I'm like, I'm upset about it. Like, how am I going to be expected? I'm expected to do, to run my business and to do all of this stuff that like a housewife would do and have kids and take care of the kids like are you fucking out of your mind like how does what do you guys do like what am i gonna do what am i what am i gonna do but like, you know what, what what do we do here like, what do you guys do i'm not gonna like your response i'm not gonna like i seriously i'm probably not gonna like your guys response i'm gonna be like oh my god women are like so powerful now like this is like what we've worked towards and this and that like no bitch like this is not what i work towards to have to have like two be like two people. Like, how, what the fuck? I'm so mad right now. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Like, how does this work? Whatever. I don't know what I'm talking about. Am I like, I don't know what I'm talking about. Actually, I do, but I'm just annoyed. I'm really annoyed. Because this is like what we've, like, is this what we fought for? Like, women's rights and shit? I feel like I always talk about this with you guys, but I don't know why I do. I just feel like it just comes up randomly. But it's, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to, I, I want to just like, I guess I wouldn't change anything. That's what's weird. It's not like I would change anything because I would never like give up my company. I love my, I love my business, but it's like now I just have so much to do that men can't do like i mean they can duh like, anyone can do anything anything but i know i'm gonna do a better job like i know for sure i'm going like i won't forget something because i know what i'm cooking you know what i mean like i'm meal planning so i know what i'm getting for the week like he wouldn't know what to get he would call me like in the, in the supermarket asking me questions i'd be like just forget it i will do it because there's no point like this is like i'm are basically i'm doing it right now and i asked you to do it right i don't know It's not fair. I'm like, I don't feel like this is not fair. This is not fucking fair. I want to like, I just want to run my business and have someone else do everything else. Is my eyebrow like way too big? At the same time, I don't either because I want to like pay someone to do that. Like pay someone to like run my errands. It's just weird. It was just, I feel like things were so much more simple back then. Like when women had did things and men did things. 
And now I have to do everything. And all he, all guys do is just work, you know? Like, we do so much more. And this is not what I wanted! So stupid. By the way, you guys, remember my, um... Remember my center console that broke? They never called me about it. They never called me. It was supposed to be here on Thursday, so I had... It was like, Nick, can you please call for me and like be like a you know be like a man in this sort of thing and be like like be a man on the like you know not not like being mean just like if a girl calls i just don't feel like i get as much help well i, do, I don't know I don't, i'm just so sick of like not getting things done so i wanted him to do it maybe he'll like be more intimidated by a guy so of course he calls and like they don't call back so i still don't have a fucking i still don't have a center console i still don't have because it's fine it's like no center console Um, what do we think? I did see Death, Pe Death Cab for Cutie on Saturday, on Sunday for Nick's birthday. And it was so good. It brought back, brought back so much, so many memories from college. I look, uh, this is not the way I look because this is fish lens. So just please remember that. Um, so much fun. It was great. It was so much fun. I loved it. It was a lot of fun. I was happy. I mean, I don't know. I really, I'm very that's I love that I love that about Nick I love that like Nick plans things like that because I'm not good at it. I'm, like, I'm like such a, a creature of habit Nick loves to try new things he loves to do things like I'm not and typically I, I almost make him not because I don't like to do new things like if I find a restaurant I like I will go to that restaurant forever like like for for example I love Mastro's like I'll go to Mastro's I would go to Mastro's like every day if I could you know what I mean and Nick loves to try new things so I think it's good because even though sometimes I don't want to I will end up like liking the thing that he finds, you know? So the other night, I'm like, I'm so happy that he, that like a couple weeks ago when he said, oh, Death Cab's playing, I was like, yeah, for sure, but it's something I would never like actually follow through with. And the fact that, I don't know, you know what I mean? I guess not, whatever, you guys, I'm just blabbing. I'm sitting here, I'm blabbing. But I don't know, it was so fun to go there. We had a good time. Kath is my favorite song ever. Like, it just reminds me so much of college. And I feel like I grew so much in college. I feel like I grew so much because I lost, that was when I, like, started to lose the weight that I had, I was, like, fat forever. And that's when I, like, wrote, like really started losing weight. So I just got more confidence. I was, like, ended up being the president of, like, this, this group on campus. Um, you know, I just, like, took charge of my life. And I just like, I don't know, I loved it. And that song, some of the songs, you know, they really like bring you back. And I just had a really good time. But the song Kath by Death Cab is really good. I love it. That was like my favorite one. And they did like, it was sound, it just was really good too. It wasn't like, oh, I wish that they would have sound better. You know, like sometimes you're like, oh, they don't sound like they do on the radio or whatever. What else? Oh my gosh, something really funny. Yesterday, do you guys remember, ugh, Blowfish, do you guys remember how I told you, like, I don't really wanna share where I go to coffee because like, when I go to coffee, I look like shit. I'm like, just getting off the phone and probably yelling at like some customer service rep who's being a fucking bitch. Um, you know, like there's just, like, like the morning when I'm when I'm driving into work where I'm going to get coffee, there's always something. Like I'm never, you know what I mean? I'm always just like elevated. So that's why another reason why I didn't want to share. Like, and I was like, I love the way you guys are like, don't fucking share. Like, that's your thing. And like, thank you because you don't understand how many people are like crazies on here. Like, email me demanding to know things. Like, bitch, I don't fucking have to tell you anything. Like, no, I don't want to run into you. Like, I don't know who you are. And it's just, people are so possessive. It's crazy. They don't think, hmm, like maybe she doesn't want to share everything she does. Um, I share a lot with you guys. Like, I don't have to share everything. Like, I don't have to share everything, you know? Um, anyway, so. It was funny, though, because the place that I go, 
I started getting these snaps from this guy, and he's like, I, he's like, I didn't see you. He's like, I don't want to come say hi. Can he's like, you just passed by my work, and I was like, I felt awkward. I was like, I'm not gonna look. I was like, I look like shit. Like I was walking the dog. Like I'm sure Ming, could, Ming was like gonna try to take a dump somewhere. Like pick it up. You know what I mean? Um, that's another thing too. Like why am I picking up dog shit? Like why am I picking up fucking dog shit too? It's annoying. Everything is annoying right now. Um, so. What was I gonna say? Oh yeah. So I snapped him back. This is when I accept. I don't say accept snaps anymore just because it got too crazy. You guys, a lot of you guys know what's going. Knew I explained why I shut off my snap messages, but um, I snapped him back. And I was like, oh, blah, blah, blah. and he's like, I work at like this place like near near where you were going and uh, whatever. So yesterday I was going to my place where I go, my coffee store, my coffee shop, and he. I parked. I guess I parked in front where he worked. And I hit totally hit the curb. I thought I crashed my car again. It was this fucking jet out. Forget it. I didn't crash my car, but I went over a curb. I'm such a fucking idiot. I need to drive a Hummer. Seriously, it's the only thing I can should be able to allow to drive. And this cute boy runs out of like the smoothie shop, and I was like, that must be him because who else? Like uh, I was like, oh yeah, I remember this. That must be the, the guy who was eat, uh, snapping me. And he's like, Alex. And I was like, oh my gosh, I was like, hi. And he's like, I just brought this for you. And he brings me out like a, like a, a little, like a, looks like a juice, but it's not. It's like coffee and it's closed. It's like locked. It's not like, you know what I mean? Like an open coffee or something. And he's like, I brought this. you have to try this. You'll love it. And I was like, oh my gosh, you're the sweetest ever. So I got in my car and I hadn't taken a sip of my coffee that I bought from the other, from another place. And it was awful. Coffee fucking sucked again. It was so bad. Wasted another six bucks and ruined my morning. And, um... I don't know. And I, I was like, I was like, hopefully his is good because maybe it will like save my day. So I tried his. It was so fucking good. So I poured out my coffee and used the ice and put his like coffee on top. And then like later he messaged me because I was like, I hope you guys have ice or whatever. He's like, we totally have ice. I just didn't want to like bring it out to you on ice because you think it was like poison or something. <laughs> and that's like something I probably totally would have been like, I was like, oh my God, like, should I drink this? Like, is it fucking poison? Is it someone who actually just fucking hates me? <laughs> <laughs> but now this is like my new favorite place and I don't know I already shared it on snap but I don't know if I'm gonna like share it share it because like then there goes the personal spot I feel like I'm gonna go in here more now but it was so good I really like this this is by Charlotte Tilbury I feel like Charlotte Tilbury is like I feel like it can be like a lot of hype but I feel like her stuff is really good you know what I mean? Because she does, like, the five-minute, like, looks and things like that. But I feel like a lot of things I've gotten from her in the past, I do like. I really like this pencil. This is Bronze Garnet. And I like the fact that she shows you, like, what looks good with green eyes, what looks good with, you know, your eye color. And I just really like this, I think. It's just easy, you know? You just, like, rub it. It's a little bit too much, honestly, for right now. Alex, like, you don't need to be wearing fucking garnet eyeshadow. Lame. I look like, I look over the top now. I just look too much. Right. I also need to get my nails done, but the bitch I go to doesn't, isn't, didn't have any time this week, of course. You guys, oh my fucking god. I don't, I don't say that. That's, like, mean. I didn't mean to say that. Sorry. Um, oh my... Oh my god, okay. Ah, I just cannot wait. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. I don't get like so stupid. But I seriously, you guys, everything is coming to a head. Like, the, the, remember I told you the things I'm like all about? Like, we had a meeting yesterday with my um, manufacturer or whatever. I, the guy who's doing it, making it all. You guys, my designs are <laughs> legit. Like, I can't fucking wait. I just like, I have pictures of them because I went to go like, Make sure everything was like I go like every two days and I bother the fuck out of him. Um, so I like can't just like let people be. But I just can't believe how good everything is coming out. I just cannot wait to show you guys. Like <sighs> HRH is really elevating, elevating itself big time. I just can't fucking wait. 
I can't wait to wear everything. I can't fucking wait. Like, enough. Come on. The problem is, you guys, everything would have been ready, but I just had, like, yesterday, for example, like, one of the prongs on the, on the things was just, like, a little bit too... So she had to, like, redo the entire mold. But whatever. It has to be perfect. It has to be fucking perfect, okay? Right, I guess I'm done. You really don't need to wear anything else. Just like, stop it. I'm also getting my extensions out tonight. Annoying. Anyway, what am I doing today? I am going to I get coffee. Then I need to get um, go to CVS and get razors. And I need to get soap, dish soap. And then I need to get coffee pods. And then I need to. I'm not. I'm not going to the supermarket. Like that is it. Then I have to come home and fucking work. Like, no. See what I mean? Like, where do I? I'm sorry. Like I. So I have to be the. I have to work and earn money, and I have to do all that too. Like, like no. Do you see what I mean? How did this happen to women? Like, how did we allow this to happen to us? Why are we sitting at home just doing the house shit, kicking our fucking feet up? Like, why did I allow this to happen to me? But I don't want like a I don't want like a husband. What's it called? Like a Mr. Mo, Mr. Mom. Like I don't want that house husband. Like I don't want that either. But then I, everything is on my shoulders. So I don't know how to like make this better. Oh, I just love this like this. I like just look like that. Okay, make you happy. <laughs> oh my god. Also, did you guys see in my snap that Core Water like saw my video and like sent me like all that water like to fill my fridge up? It was so funny. Um. And I had one that was open before, but I guess Nick took it. Taking all the benefits. <laughs> what the fuck is that water I was drinking? Oh, whatever. I was going to drink it, but I want to open up a new one. Okay, guys. So I will. I don't know if I'm going to bring you along with me or what. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't like when the whole house shows. It's just, like, very invasive. Um, I hate the stove. I just, I can't, I just can't with the stove. It's like so gross. CPS Ming, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna get fucking dishwasher so this is so interesting. Okay, so I don't look as fat right now, right? It's like fat. <sighs> Ming, stop that. Ming. Dishwasher, dishwasher, dishwasher soap. Come on, Ming. Ming, why are you being bad? Okay. Watch me kick out of here too. Ming, can you please walk? No filming a lot. Stupid. Like anyone gives a fuck about CBS. Making everyone car sick, I know, sorry. It's like I'm like dragging my feet today. I'm just like not in the mood for this. Come on, Ming. This manager's right behind me. Great. Kicked out. Watch, watch. Please don't kick me out. Fuck. He did good. Not good for that right now. People really steal razors. Like, oh my god. Right now, I'm gonna go interact with the manager with the dog in my hand. Oh, let me show you guys this. So, I got my coffee. I fixed my shirt so I don't look like a fucking cow. It's like impossible in these shirts not to look like a cow. Um, okay, so now I'm going, because I, I got my coffee. This is my almond milk coffee that I love from that place that my subby works at. I didn't see him today, he wasn't. He said he works every day, but he wasn't there. Maybe he was like on lunch break or something. Of course I went during lunch. It would have been nice to say hi to him because he showed me this. Um, so now I'm going to CVS. I'll see him again. I'm be coming here a lot. So um, I am gonna go to CVS now, like I told you guys. Um, 
just running fucking errands you know how, how it goes when you like own a business and and you have to be a housewife I just feel like there's such a huge can we like does this look like I have rolls this is what like this is starting to like I look huge like this is not funny I'm not cute at all I look like a melted snowman don't I this is gross I think it looks cuter standing up or in the mirror what are you doing Um, but I have like that 30% when are you guys I've talked about this in my vlog a long time ago Are you guys like me when you get that 30% off coupon from CVS you like stock the fuck up? I have 30% off coupon and I have a dollar coupon too um, <laughs> Stacks on sex coupons so fucking cheap. I love it <laughs> um, I love this weather. It's so gloomy. I feel so inspired and so I, like, I wanna like work the fuck, you know what I mean? I wanna work so hard when it's gloomy out. I hate the sun because you have to wear like skimpy clothes and I'm too fat to wear skimpy clothes. So I love like gloomy weather because it gives an excuse to wear. Plus it's like nice and cool out. I don't like to be hot. I don't, I don't like hot weather. I like gloomy weather. It's my favorite. I wanna move. I wanna move to like Seattle or like, you know, up north. I, would, I feel like I would do better up there. Nick would never go. Nick would like never leave LA. Match made in heaven, right? <laughs> mm -hmm. okay. So I'll go to see if, which way is CVS again? Uh, straight through. Like I'm hungry right now too, because it's like one o'clock, so I don't know what to do. Should I like have lunch by myself later? Maybe I will like have lunch somewhere. Like in, I'm going to get an espresso coffee pods. So maybe I'll like have lunch in Beverly Hills alone. It's kind of sad, isn't it? Honestly, I can't look at myself anymore. I look like I'm, I am look like a butch melted snowman. I look like I have no tits and like this huge white melted snowman. Like I can't even look at myself anymore. Open up the razors. Right. Idiot. Who the fuck steals razors? Hi, can I get razors? Fucking annoying. Now they're no filming, so I gotta turn this off before I get in trouble. Watch. Okay, I got this one and this one. Because they're the most the ones without any like fluff. Like, why would you want to smell like pomegranate? I don't get it. which I think is so cute um, and like a tan you know. um, and I just like it because I'm like so fat right now that I just need something like a little bit loose you know what I mean so it doesn't like really show everything um, but I'm like tired of wearing men's clothes so I think this is a good alternative all you guys know what it, let me see thank you so much <laughs> and then I met one of you guys in front two years This will be a surprise because I'm like talking to you outside, but hydro. <laughs> okay, so I got some things. Do we love this? I feel like this is very cool on me. Can you tell? Actually, I look very pregnant right now, but I'm not, I swear. God. I don't know if it looks good in this lighting, but I think it's very cool. Can we even tell? Ming, I 
know you want to go, don't you? You've been so good. I'm going to go walking, walking. Don't worry, Angel. I love you so much. Are you sitting on my jacket? Yeah, good girl.